Good morning, YouTube land. You see my grandson here, Noah. So we are, uh, this is December the 23rd, and I gave him a DJI Spark, DJI Spark drone for Christmas. We got it all set up last night. It was, uh, I ordered the drone and then or for, on Amazon, I ordered the drone and then I ordered the controller separate. So we had to pair the controller with the drone because they were not compared, paired together. That was easy. We read the instructions, told us how to do it. The part where we had trouble was his Android phone had a setting in it to where it, when you link into the Wi-Fi on the Spark drone, it, he didn't have cell service and you have to have cell service with that Wi-Fi so you can do the updates and so on So it took us a while finding that button to get that switched on, but we finally got it all linked We are in some wind right now. We've had a tremendous amount of rain last night We're in a dry spell right now. So we're gonna to try to go out and fly up, but I stopped down here uh, to show you real quick uh, Of course you recognize you uh, older videos, you know the salon there that my daughters that I remodeled well, my wife bought a house that sits right beside of it, and which is right here. Not much to look at right now, but she's got plans for it of what she's going to do with it, but she will not let me share it with you right now, what's going to be done, what she's going to use this house for. Uh, it's going to be painted outside. She's trying to come up with a color. We're going to rip out all the landscaping. Of course, we've ripped out the landscaping on the salon over there. It's got to be re-landscaped. Probably going to do all this in the spring when we're going to do that. So this is going to be painted, re-landscaped. Uh, we're painting it inside right now. I've got a guy painting in here. This is Lee. He's doing the painting on the house. And this is just an old house she bought. I don't know if this camera's fogged up or not. I'm fogged up. My glasses will go back outside. Get back out here, maybe my glasses will clear up. I don't know about the lens on the camera because I can't even see myself. I haven't made any rental property videos since I've been back from Las Vegas. Get in here, we'll get out of this wind. It, that wind is cold. We've had about a 20 degree drop in temperature overnight. We're down in the 30s, we were in the 50s. But anyway, I kind of want to just show you that house real quick. I've just bought another house. And when you see that house, you're going to be quite surprised. And that's all I'm going to say about it, but I'll try to this week. Coming up in the next week, I'll try to show you that house. But uh, since I've been back from Vegas, I have been doing some work on some rental houses, but people live in them. And when people live in them, I'm just real hesitant about taking the camera because of they have their stuff in their house and I don't want to, you know, broadcast that all over everywhere and just show their house and their things and things like that. So I just don't take the cameras in. Let's go out here to the park and fly this drone because you know how it is when you get a new toy, man, you're excited <laughs> to fly it. So yeah. Noah's excited to fly the Spark. I've never been around the Spark. so. We just kind of want to see how it operates, and it is real cold, and it's kind of windy. It'll be a good test on the wind, and so on. So let's go out there and do that. Noah's getting his spark set up. While he's setting it up, I'll tell you a couple more things. Um, I've got a new DeWalt tool ordered. Uh, I've ordered it on Amazon. It's not released yet, so there's not a delivery date set on it not gonna tell you what it is you just have to wait and see it when it comes in um, so I have that I know coming up I have uh, quite a bit of rental stuff property stuff coming up I've got a lot of stuff in the works and going on and like I said that's kind of really the basics of what my channel is about is the rental property because that's where my money's made from so that drives everything we're out here at this uh, Russellville City Park as you can see it's kind of our best place here in Russellville to that I know of that I've got access to to come fly the drone. It's uh, you know just a small park. We're in a small city here. Also, this morning I, I want to say thank you to you people uh, that subscribe to my channel and those of you that uh, comment. Like this morning, I was answering comments. Um, just had a guy that made a nice comment. Want to say thank you for the videos and so on. 
and he lives a few miles from here. I've been answering comments about my Ferris mower, I've been answering comments about some DeWalt tools, and all of you are just so kind uh, in your comments, and you're so appreciative, and I appreciate that. So he's getting this thing linked yep. up. It's linked up. Already, lights are, you can just take it off right up okay. here. The lights are blinking green. Let me move over behind him so we can get a shot of this thing taking off. You might remember if you saw the video of Thanksgiving that Noah's first time with a drone was I brought him out here and we flew the GoPro drone and we flew the DJI. I always want to call them DJI, DJI Mavic. And that was his first time to ever be around a drone, fly a drone, and he fell in love with them and really liked them because they are very addicting. And so my wife and I wanted to get him this drone for Christmas. Man, that thing is smooth and it is steady. Uh -huh. That's the thing that I like about DJI products. Yeah. You like but it? The video footage is amazing on it. Getting cold? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's cold today, especially when you've been used to it being. For the last week, we've been 50s and 60s, and today we're in the 30s. It's made a overnight change. So you can bring it in, just set it down on the truck bed right here if you want to. See how he does here. Man, that's good, Noah. Mm -hmm. Man, I tell you, this drone, it is just so cool, just so compact. It, it is just cool. Look, check that out. I mean, that, that dude is just cool. Compared to that Mavic, it's... Pretty small. It is. And still high tech. Yes, and very high tech. And what I liked about this was just the ease of throwing it in a backpack. Of course, he doesn't have a case right now. We just got the case that it came in. Yep. Let's turn it off. Like, uh, you know, me going to play golf and stuff like that, I, I will take my Mavic with me because it's small enough I can put it in the uh, golf bag and take it out with me where the GoPro one's not. You know, and you just got this little case, of course, there sitting on my hand, if that can kind of give you a little indication. You know, just, man, it'd be simple to throw in your backpack in a golf bag or something and take that with you. It's pretty cool. Yep. All right, let's go, man. We're about to freeze. Noah and I was just talking about him bringing that spark in and landing it on the back of my truck. Yep. Man, that drone is smooth. And, and it's a little bit of wind out today. It's, it's a little breezy. Yep. I really like the compact size of it. Yeah, really, I like really that. do too. Like, yeah, it's I, just easy, simple. I really like that. Good Christmas present, huh? Yeah, yeah, that's <laughs> a really good Christmas present. I really like it. No one, I got our Walmart shopping done. I should have taken a video camera in to Walmart. That's unorganized chaos. I guess everybody doing last minute Christmas stuff. We got it in though. Well guys, Noah and I are back and we've had a good day, been all over Bowling Green and different things and I just wanted to make a short video of him being here and flying his Spark drone then I kind of wanted to do you an update a little bit and tell you that starting next week I'll get back on the rental property and make some rental property videos and things like that. So I hope all of you have a Merry Christmas. I thank you for watching and liking and subscribing and all the things you do. And as I said before, I get just such great comments and they're always kind and nice. And I really appreciate that and the encouragement you give me. And I hope you have a happy new year, but I'll see you before then. Thank y'all.